A Missouri federal judge dismissed a lawsuit from Kansas City-based UMB Bank against Dr. Michael Coleman of Greenwood after learning the parties had settled the case stemming from the failure of the notorious Express Grain Company. Of course, no one's talking about the terms and probably never will. UMB had sued Dr. Coleman, who owned 99% of Express Grain, while his son, John, ran it. Unlike his son, who faces huge civil and criminal charges, Dr. Coleman has never faced any accusations in the Express Grain case. UMB had filed this complaint saying the good doctor owed $93 million in unpaid loans and interest. Dr. Coleman denied owing the money, saying that he didn't sign the paperwork the bank had on file. In the meantime, the federal court sent the whole thing to mediation. With all this going on, the lawsuit against the Express Grain auditors from Farmers and Homes in Tallahatchie counties went from state to federal court to be heard by the same judge handling the big Express Grain case. While all that was going on, the new bankruptcy trustee in the case said he uncovered assets which he says should go to creditors. While that gets sorted out, the case remains open while we await John Coleman's federal and state criminal trials, which those in the know say may not happen until next year. Dennis Turner, The Delta News.